What's up, you crazy fighting entrepreneurs? Guess who it is? Your favorite person in the whole wide world, Onyx and all, back with another killer episode. How I sold my first $100,000 using digital products, my favorite types. I'm gonna go through a story here that took place, but even though this story took place starting in like 2004, I feel ancient just saying that, but the story is still relevant today and the lessons from it are relevant today. So it took me about four months, maybe a little over four months, okay? Now, disclaimer here, I am not promising that you can make your first $100,000 doing exactly what I did. It's my story. Secondly, might be a little bit off on some of the numbers. Come on, guys, give me a break. It's been over 20 years. <laughs> my memory's a little bit foggy, but I, I remember it pretty much to the degree. I'm going to try to get the numbers as close as possible for you. So it took me about four months to kind of get to this $100,000 number. And I think back to what I did back then, and I realized, and I'm amazed at how relevant it is today. But before I get started, make sure you join us at the brand new site that we just launched, learnexpert.com, L-U-R-N-E-X-P-E-R-T.com. It's it's absolutely free. We got a brand new community of experts, those who are course creators, coaches, and consultants. I've got a free course. It might be coming out soon or might already be out. Just go to the site, find out. We have an amazing Facebook group and we have a brand new newsletter that we've launched. This is only for experts, infopreneurs. It's absolutely free. Go join us. Learn, L-U-R-N, expert, E-X-P-E-R-T.com. All right? And onicpodcast.com to binge listen to all of our amazing episodes. So let's dive right in. It's 2004, kids. Pile around the room and let's turn the fireplace on. 2004, I've been trying to make money for a long time at this point. I've been struggling. It's been about 18 months. I've made a little bit of money here and there, a little AdSense money here, maybe a sale here, a sale there, nothing to write home about. And I'm getting pretty freaking frustrated. Now, Back then there used to be a forum called ablake.net. Okay, loved it. It was more of a chat board. I wish it would come back. I really do. It was it was my home away from home, but I was on there for hours a day and I would ask questions and questions and questions. I would answer people too, but mostly I would ask questions. And actually I was coined as the most annoying kid, lovingly, I think. But I was also always trying. They saw that I'm trying. I would launch new things, try new things, do this, do that, and it just wouldn't work. 18 months of doing that, I was falling apart, man. My head was going crazy. So. Finally, one day I was basically ready to quit. I even posted on the forum. I said, I'm done. If I don't make some money in the next 24 hours, I quit. Well, I got this message from a person. This is a true story. You believe me or not. I don't know if you're spiritual or not, but I believe this was an angel because I till this day do not know this person's name. They messaged me on the chat board, sent me a private message. And they basically said, kid, I'm going to help you. I don't want to see you quit. I've been watching you hustle hard, but here's some rules of the game. I won't tell you who I am. And you got to do this for other people in the future. I almost said no. And then I was like, what the hell do I have to lose? I'm up at night. I'm like, help me out, dude. I'm so burned out. I don't know what the hell I'm doing. So he walked me through a few steps. And I want to share with you exactly what he had me do, because this is how I made my first money. Actually, I woke up the next morning. So I worked with him until like, or her, I don't know, until two or three in the morning, passed out, woke up about six hours later, had to run to an exam and I checked my ClickBank account. That's probably where I made my first big money was ClickBank. I'd made $310 overnight while I slept. It was insane. And like most, like 95% of that came from this campaign that he or she had helped me put together. And then I somehow randomly got another sale that got it up to $310. So it worked. So what did we do? Well, what he had me do that night, or she had me, sorry, if I keep saying he, I mean he or she, I don't know who it was. What this person had me do that night, they noticed something. They said, you post on this forum all the time, but you never use your signature file. And I said, I don't have anything to put in my signature. And this person's like, you're missing out on a great source of traffic from a group of people that see you all the time. And pretty much know you. And I said, well, I don't know what to put in there. So one of the things this person noticed was that there was a software that had been released back then called Traffic Equalizer. This was, for lack of better examples, pretty much a spam software. It like would spam Google with a bunch of pages on your website and you'd get all this SEO traffic. And I had used it. I'd bought the software, I'd used it. I had like a little bit of success with it. I'd made a couple few hundred bucks here and there with AdSense money. I didn't have a website, I didn't have any business. I'd made some AdSense money. And I gotten kind of good at installing the software onto an FTP server. I don't know how I figured it out because till this day I can't put a website up if you put a freaking gun to my head. What I did is I started answering questions about the software. People would ask, this software was like really popular back then. It was created by a guy named Jeff Alderson and it just got very popular. Popular. Like, I mean, thousands of people were buying it. So on this forum, people are like asking questions. I can't get this. I'm getting this error. I'm getting this. And this was the first time I felt like, hey, I can actually help people. So for weeks, I had been answering people's questions about the software. And this individual who had messaged me said, I noticed you're answering people's questions, but you don't use a signature file. You could put your affiliate link in that signature file. I'm like, oh God, here we go. The affiliate marketing stuff, blah, 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 right? It's like, okay. So I said, but I'm going to be coachable. I'm going to stay up. So this person had me do the following. We put up a very ugly page that night. I wrote a little bit of copy. It was 
basically what I was putting up was a pre-sales page. It was a review of the software, some screenshots, some of my results, how many sites I had installed. And basically what I said at the end of it was, hey, if you purchase this software through my link, I'll give you my personal email address. I'll give you my personal cell phone number and I'll support you. I'll offer you an extra level of support for using the software for free. And you know what? Funny thing. One of my closest friends in the marketing world till this day, his name is Greg Caesar, was the only person who saw that phone number on the page and called me. It's so nuts. He actually called me. I woke up and a couple of days later and was like, phone was ringing. It was him. So I put all this together that night and it took more of maybe a few hours. And this person is messaging me back and forth on this thread on the forum and helping me out. And I put this page up and what they asked me to do was they said, now go fill in your signature file. Because what happens is when you put your signature file in, it populates it into all the past messages. So all of the messages I've had on the forum for a long time, it puts them in there. So it was like an immediate ability to open a floodgate of traffic, right? Highly targeted traffic. And so I put my signature file. I basically wrote something about how to get X XYZ traffic using this software. I'll help for free, dot, dot, dot. Went to bed, woke up about six hours later, had made $310. I think I sold four or five copies of the software that night. And I had some major lessons I learned from it. So we're going to stop right here. Okay. Cause that led me to making about 10 to $15,000 a month. I was consistent after that. I never had a day where I sold less than $300 or made less than $300 in commissions with that software for months to come because my signature file was in the links everywhere. And then I got more aggressive and I would make more posts, more posts, more posts, more posts. Post. Why not? Because my link, I know now I know I'm going to be getting a lot of traffic. So I want to share four key lessons I learned and we're going to keep going. Like I'm going to show you what I did month two, month three and month four. And each one has like a little lesson that relates to how you can use it today. So the first one, my key lessons, four key lessons. First, I used affiliate marketing to make my first money. It was easy. I didn't have to do any of the hard work, no product creation, no product delivery, no messaging, no transactions, nothing super easy. But I picked the $150 software. Now, this is the truth. I don't know if the commission was 50% or 75%. I just don't remember. And I tried checking and I couldn't find it. I should just ask Jeff. I'm still connected to Jeff, the guy who had created it. So I took a higher cost product and my commission is so high because it's a digital product. This is why I love courses and coaching and consulting because these are high margin. Number two lesson, I created a pre-sales page. This is still relevant today. I had recently on this podcast, a great affiliate by the name of Chris Reed. What did he talk about? He uses YouTube to get a bunch of sales with affiliate products on ClickBank. He talked about a pre-sales page. It's super important. What's a pre-sales page? Just a little review page where you prime the pump, get someone kind of in the know about what you're about to you know, show them. Number three, added a bonus. I didn't even know I was doing this. Today, it's like one of the most used strategies. I had no idea, but I ended up adding a bonus. The bonus was you get my email and you get my phone number and I'll support you for free. And number four was you don't need a lot of traffic to make money, everyone. A lot of people out there think you need to have thousands and thousands and thousands of visitors to make $10,000 or $15,000 and you don't. Now, again, I'm not promising anything to you, right? I'm not saying that if you do the strategy I'm sharing with you today, that you'll make 10 or 15,000, that would be stupid. I'm not saying that. But what I'm saying is my traffic was super targeted. Hence, I didn't need much. I mean, gosh, how many clicks could I have gotten that one night? It was six hours, maybe a hundred clicks, maybe 50, 60, 70 clicks, but it's super ultra targeted. And so that was my fourth lesson was, hey, you could do a lot with little traffic. You just needed to be super targeted. Okay. So I started making about anywhere from 10 to $15,000 a month. It's awesome, right? Like, how crazy is that? Okay, we move to now the next month. Okay, so this is month two. And by the way, if you're watching on YouTube, you see I have notes. Like I actually had to write notes because I wanted to make sure I covered everything for you. So month two, I made about 25,000. Where's the jump come from? It wasn't what you think. It wasn't that I started selling more software. No, I was sold about the same amount. But here's what happened. This is so crazy. I sold the software, right? So I'm giving my email address and my phone number to people. And one of the persons had some supplement. It was like water purifying supplement. It was like a weird supplement. I remember till this day. The website was like all purple and blue. I still remember it. And this individual messaged me and said, listen, I don't have time to install this. I don't have time to do all of this. Can I just pay you to do it? You go in and just install the software for me. First time anyone asked me that, I'm like, shoot. All right. So the truth was it took me about two hours to do this thing. From start to finish, I could have the whole thing installed on someone's web it's like page for like two hours. Now I didn't know, I didn't know what to charge. In my head, I was only like thinking like hundred bucks, 200 bucks. By the way, I'm a broke college kid. Like I'm just getting started. So, and I'm making a little bit of money right now. I'm bright eyed, bushy tail. I don't know what's going on. So I responded to the person. I said, I'd be interested, but what are you offering? I didn't answer the question because I don't know how much I'm on a charge. And this person responded and said, I'll pay you $500 for the website. <sighs> what? Really? Like, that's amazing. That's $250 an hour for me. So I said, yes. Awesome. He sent me over his information. I installed it. I did it like the same night. The next day he's shocked. He's like, oh my God, it's done already. Yep. A week later, traffic is pouring in for him. He's like, hey, here's two more sites. I sent you a thousand dollar PayPal. Do it to these two sites. Okay. Took the weekend. Pop. Done. Monday. I got a buddy. He wants you to do it to his site. 
I don't know, man, what is happening here, right? Like money's pouring in. Now I'm also like burning out a little bit. I'm like, oh God, I'm just keep installing this thing, but I'm making money. The next thing I know, I'm like, maybe I should message everybody who has bought the software through me because I know because they're emailing me. Maybe I should just say, hey, by the way, I'm doing this thing. Well, turns out my second month, I sold a bunch of them. <laughs> I probably sold like 20 plus of them. So that's where I made the extra 10 grand. Now I'm sitting there making 25 grand in month two. So I, here I was less than two months ago, ready to quit. And now I'm like making multiple six figures sitting in college in my dorm room, well, apartment. Month two key lesson. Can you take an existing affiliate product that sells very well and layer over top of it a service? Okay, the first thing I thought of is like, I am a big affiliate for jasper.ai. Well, I'm not that big. I need to be bigger, but I'm going to be, I'm coming. So it's a great tool. It writes copy, automated copy, right? Robotic copy. Well, couldn't there be a service on top of that? What is a product or a software out there that already sells like crazy? That's a key thing. It sells really, really well that you could layer a service over. That would be a digital service or a digital product. So keep that in mind, okay? We go to month three and it's blowing up. I'm miserable. I made like 30 plus thousand dollars that month and I am totally miserable. I like walk around with my head. You know, I am still a full-time college kid and I better keep my college grades up. Otherwise my dad's gonna. So I'm tired. I'm doing like multiple sites a day. Then I got people messaging me questions because of the bonus I offered them if they buy the affiliate software through me. Then I got clients who have already pulled the website. They, they broke something. I gotta go fix it. It's like kind of really stacking up. So of course I'm complaining and month three, I get this idea from someone. I don't know their name. They were on the forum. They're like, why don't you just stop doing it? <laughs> well, cause I'm making money, man. I don't want to stop doing it. He's like, no, listen, why don't you just record yourself installing it? You said it takes two hours. Just turn the camera on, turn the screen camera on. Back then we had screencast. Just record your screen with a voice. And like, as you're installing it, just keep like recording it and make a bunch of videos and sell that for $500. Now this is before I even knew how to put up membership login websites. So I was like, damn, that sounds smart. Now let me give it a shot. So I filmed it. I used screencast. I edited it. I figured out how to burn CDs, like to burn them on CDs. And like, I created a little course that I would put in a box. It's like, this is cool. And now I needed a bunch of them made. Well, I didn't know about fulfillment companies and all that. So what did I do? I went to Best Buy, bought five computers, hired my friends, paid them nickels on the dollar to say, sit here and burn CDs. So month three, that's what I did. And by month four, I launched it. Well, let me pause here and offer you a key lesson that I want you to think about. Ready? How can you turn that limited service into a scalable information product? And that's exactly what I did. Well, check this out. Month number four, I went and messaged all the people that had bought the software through me. I changed the link on my signature file in the forum to a sales page that had a picture of my course and said, this is what my course is. It was called dominatesearchengines.com. You can still go back and probably find the archives and see the page dominatesearchengines.com. And month four, just by announcing it to my existing buyers and putting it on that forum, I made 50 grand. Well, I made 50 grand the whole month. I sold probably about 10 consultation packages. I sold the usual 10 to 15,000 of the software. So I made another like 25 grand. By the way, I sold it for the same price. That was a crazy Part. I sold it for $500. This course you get was the same amount of money that I would do for you. People didn't care. It sold like crazy because the positioning I gave it was, hey, why pay me $500 to do it for you once when I can, you can pay me $500 and you can do it for as many sites as you want. It totally worked. But this is where it got really fun. You ready? So now I've made $100,000. We're about four months in. I'm sitting on this product. I got a, it was so funny. I literally had like a sweatshop going on in my apartment. My roommates are complaining. There's like, poof. There's computers everywhere. I eventually figured out that there's such a thing as a fulfillment house. Holy crap, was that life changing for me? But month five, Jeff Alderson, the creator of the software I had been an affiliate for, comes to me and says, hey, what's this thing you got over here? I was like, oh man, it's killing. It's selling crazy. I got a $500 course where it's like a, where I show people how to like do a better job using what you're selling them. And, and Jeff's like, hey, can I mail this to all my buyers? I'm like, would you? That would be freaking ama amazing, yes. So he starts mailing it to his 10,000 plus customers who've spent 150 plus dollars with him and the sales just went whew, took off. Went on for a few months, it was awesome. And then of course, Google found, figured out how to slap the crap out of Traffic Equalizer and it no longer worked and that killed my first information product. But I had made multiple six figures. This was my junior year of college and that for me was the light going on where I said, information products and Onik are gonna be friends. We are here to stay. <laughs> 
All right, so the key lesson here for you was go partner with the same person who you are an affiliate for. But the thing to note here is you can do it with small traffic. You don't have to have big traffic. Find a community that you can mine the smallest amount of targeted traffic from and you can make big numbers happen, okay? So use affiliate marketing. Find something that is digital and expensive. 100, 150 bucks, you'll make a lot more money. Create a pre-sales page, add a bonus. Little traffic is great traffic. How can you find an existing selling product or something or software and layer on your own service to it. And then how can you turn that service into an information product? And then how can you go back to the company who you're an affiliate for and get them to promote this new information product? Ladies and gentlemen, that formula is still very applicable today, isn't it? And you can absolutely use it. So I hope this got you thinking. I hope it got your mind going. Do it. Come on. It's just a matter of just going out and doing it. Listen, if you want to join us in our absolutely free community where we talk nothing but how to sell information, how to sell coaching, how to sell consulting. It's our expert community. It's free. Go to learnexpert.com. L-U-R-N expert. E-X-P-E-R-T.com. It's absolutely free. You're going to get our newsletter. You're going to get my course that's coming out. That's absolutely going to be free on how to do basically infopreneurship. And you're also going to get to join our Facebook community where we talk about all of this and answer your questions and help guide you along the process of creating information products. All right. It's been awesome. Make sure you go to onicpodcast.com as well and listen to all of our amazing episodes click subscribe below click like leave me a comment do all the fun stuff so we can make sure we're getting this message out to as many people in the world as possible right this is onik reminding you when life pushes you stand straight smile and push it the heck back talk to you later bye thanks for listening to the fighting entrepreneur with your host onik singal 